Hello beautiful souls, I hope you all are doing well. I'm Anita Svetlana, welcome to your reading. A big thank you to each and every one of you for all the love and support that you show towards my channel. Uh, this reading is going to be the October reading for Pisces. So please remember that this is a general collective reading, so please pick up messages that you resonate to. Don't forget to like, comment and consider subscribing and sharing the video as well. Okay, so you have justice, you have page of cups, and you have four of swords. So, with the justice card, okay, what is it that you're fighting for? Okay, it's time for you to, you know, stop that fighting and uh, sometimes, you know, the fight is within yourself. You know, sometimes you fight with yourself. It's about, you know, the right and the wrong. And uh, you need to find a balance in your life. You need to find a balance for yourself. Also, in the fight, in case there is a conflict that is going on, remember, karma always comes back. Okay? So, so be mindful about what you do. With a page of cups, you know, the page of cups is is drawing and is taken up like a new hobby but then he's paint the she's painting so with the page of cups it's time for you to let out your creativity it's time for that creativity to flow okay you this month okay october you'll have a huge blessing on your creativity so work you know stay focused on your creativity and 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 work on it okay uh, do what you love in case you feel that oh i'm not a creative person no pick up a new hobby and get that creativity out it's time for you to get that creativity out four of swords are you sleeping well it's time for you to rest basically it's time for you to sleep also to sleep well I ensure that you take proper pauses so that you you rest well also it's time for you to heal Okay, so so take that pause at the right time so that you can heal. Take that pause at, at the right time so that you can rest well and recharge well. Four of Cups, Six of Pentacles. So. Nice. So. With the Four of Cups, why do you keep going back to your past? Why do you keep thinking about the past? You know, it's time for you to walk away and leave that past behind. Okay. And you might you might have been hurt about uh, a, a situation or you might have been hurt about the past and you, you might be carrying a lot of wounds uh, from your past. But it's finally time for you to walk away and let go of that past. Okay. Like I said with the Four of Swords, it's time for you to heal. So, you know, don't keep looking back uh, at your past. And in case you have been dissatisfied with your life or, you know, bored with your life, it is time to move on, okay? Look at the future with a lot of hope and optimism, okay? Be at peace with yourself. You know, sometimes life stings, but you need to rise up from that. Okay, with the Six of Pentacles, don't forget to pay it forward. Okay, share that abundance that you have and, and, and pay and remember to pay it forward. It is, it is very important always because there has to be an equal give and take. Let it be, you know, your money, your career, relationship. If you have been a giver, remember that it is okay to receive also. That's why, uh, you know, I, I said this. There has to be an equal give and take. You have to be open to receiving as well. So in case if you're in need of assistance or any help, it is okay to receive that help. But if you already have, you know, a, a, a lot and abundant, uh, you are abundant and uh, you have been receiving a, a lot of prosperity or abundance in your life. Remember, you need to pay it forward. Okay. Knight of Cups. 
So where do you want to go flying? Okay. You know, uh, you want to follow wherever your heart leads. And uh, it's a nice thing, you know, to, 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 to follow your heart. But uh, be logical, be realistic. And you might be, uh, you know, uh, a romantic soul. And of course, you are Pisces. So you, <laughs> you know it better. You tend to build castles in the air and you get very dreamy and you tend to get wrapped up in your own dreams and visions but follow them you know execute when you come to ex uh, execution you know be realistic be practical okay whatever you are pursuing right now pursue it with your uh, with your whole heart be passionate about it and you know all the bliss that is there is going to follow okay uh, it is time for you to voice out and share with the world who you are and what you are and uh, how do i say it uh, be open to, to to receiving the recognition that you that you deserve follow your passion okay and focus on your dreams and manifest your dreams okay uh, what else do I get uh, for you guys also uh, you know in case I already said that in case you need help accept that help and don't forget to have healthy boundaries for yourself trust your intuition and have healthy boundaries okay And don't be too emotional. Okay. You are never alone. So remember that, that you are never alone. So time for beginner's mind. So uh, look at things or your situation with a lot of curiosity, look at it from a different perspective, look at it from, you know, a child's vision, like a beginner, you know, with a lot of curiosity. And maybe you will uh, be able to find the answers for what whatever you're finding or looking for, searching or looking for. Be playful, okay? Don't forget to have fun. Be playful in your relationship as well. And don't forget to have fun. You, you you can't be all work, work, work. Magic works through you. So you need to believe in your magic. Okay. You know that you are a magical being. And, and, and you know that you have that magic within you. So you need to believe in that magic. Don't doubt your inner magic. What are you afraid of? Okay. And... Uh, Remember, now is the time for you to accomplish all your desires and especially, you know, all your creative uh, ideas and any creative uh, desires that you have, they are going to come to fruition. You do have miracles, you do have opportunity, abundance, love, everything will just show up in your life from nowhere because they will magically or come into your life because you will manifest it magically okay finding so you will find whatever you've been looking for you'll find the answers some of you will find yourself and your dreams blessings so you do have a lot of blessings coming in your life new beginning so welcome the new beginning that is going to come into your life and you will find the peace that you have been looking for. Okay. Okay. So stay focused on your dreams and desires. Your family is always around you to support you. They, they always have your back. So you are never alone. Wisdom. So use your wisdom to, to take the decisions in case you are at a crossroad. You are a very wise person. So use your inner knowing. 
happiness so you do have happiness coming into your life a lot of happiness in fact i will say okay let's look at your october blessings okay mm. So you have a blessing on, on your day. So your October is going to be magical. A blessing for unity where once there was division. So in case there have been conflict, there will be a reconciliation. And a blessing of protection. So you will be protected. Okay. And you're always protected. Your angels are always around you. All right. So. My dear Pisces, I'm going to leave your reading here for you. Let me know in the comments how did you like and resonate to the reading. Don't forget to like, comment and consider subscribing and sharing the video as well. And I will see you next time for your next reading. Thank you. Love and light.